Good evening. This is Pamela, and you are listening to Watchmen on the Pod. Well, it's been a few days since we did our devotional. I'm sorry, people. I've had so much going on in my own personal, private life that things kind of got all messed up. But here I am. I am back. Okay. Uh, Today we are reading, remember, from our Daily Bread devotionals. And our reading for today is Psalms chapter 8, only one verse, verse 4. What is mankind that you are mindful of them? Who are you? His name, his name is Diane. I think it's Diane. D-N-Y-A-N. Diane. And he considers himself a student of the world. And this is a very big school. He says of all the cities and towns he's passed through. He began a four-year journey on his bicycle in 2016 to meet and learn from people. When there's a language barrier, he finds that sometimes people can understand just by looking at each other. He also depends on a translation app on his phone to communicate. He doesn't measure his journey in miles he's traveled or the sights he's seen. Instead, he measures it in the people who've left an imprint on his heart. Maybe I do not know your language, but I would like to find out who you are. It's a very big world, yet God knows everything about it and the people in it fully and completely. The psalmist David was in awe of God when he considered all the works of his hands, the making of the heavens, the moon, and the stars, Psalms 8, 3. He wondered, what is mankind that you are mindful of them and human beings that you care for them, verse 4. God knows you more thoroughly than anyone else possibly can, and he cares for you. We can only respond, Lord, our Lord, how majestic is your name in all the earth. (sighs) How beautiful. And that was written from Anne Sitas. Our questions for today is, how do you feel knowing that God knows all about you and loves you? What does believing this truth look like in your life today? And our prayer, dear God, it's awesome to realize that you're all knowing about your whole creation. I love you for knowing me personally too. Amen. So beautiful. It says in the word of God that, you know, he knows every hair that's on our head. He has them numbered. He also says that the tears that we shed, he bottles them up. He loves us very, very much, and He knows us. The thing is, He knows what we used to be, and He still loves us. You know, it says that while we were yet sinners, Christ died for us. That's love. He loves us. Well, I love you all so very, very much. Keep your eyes on Jesus, brothers and sisters. Your nose in the book. And embed the word of God upon the tablets of your hearts so you will not sin against God. You have a great evening. Bye-bye.